Eminem releases tomorrow, November 29th in the item shop and Epic Games hooked it up with the secret sauce from Mom Spaghetti. Epic Games, thank you for the early access. We have three outfits, three back wings, two harvesting tools and a glider to go over. The first outfit in this video will be covering Slim Shady. Three edit styles, will you please stand up? Reactive to Elims, I'll show you that in game. We have the headphone style as well. And then we have the final style called Shady Demon. Now there is a built-in emote that will go in between the Slim Shady style and the Shady Demon style. Regardless of the headphone style, it will not go back to the headphone style. So this is the mask up built-in emote. Very cool. And if you do it again, it will go back to the uh, default Slim Shady style. Regardless of the headphone data style, keep that in mind. The back bling is reactive to emotes called the Shady Boombox. Harvesting tool, one of two, called the Shady Double Saw, is reactive to hitting weak points. I should be able to preview that as well here. It will become more of a uh, bright orange. The Contra will be more of an aggressive orange as well once you hit the weak points, and it will slowly go back to the original style. The glider has two edit styles. This is the Raven Express Glider, part of the M&M set. And then the edit style for the other one is called Jet Fighter which is actually pretty cool. It's all like that. It kind of reminds me of Top Gun. So Slim Shady in game. Oh, let's get sweaty. Okay, so I do want to point out this harvesting tool that I currently have is not compatible with every experience within Fortnite to include E10+. E you cannot use this harvesting tool in those games. Keep that in mind. Backling reactive to emotes. And then turn off the reactivity here. Do it at night as well. Looks pretty cool. Change the time of day, back to normal. The glider, excuse me. The glider is called the Raven Express. Okay. I don't see anything crazy with contrails, any crazy visuals with thrusters or jets, but I like the way you do stand on it. Kind of like the goblin glider equip and equip of the harvesting tool. A little bit of like a smoke trail right now without it being reactive yet impact is okay but this is where the magic happens hitting weak points you see the streak already changed and it will slowly go back to normal here without that glow and then on the steel Looks pretty cool and it will slowly go back to normal now this edit style to my knowledge does have the reactive sound on an elim but it doesn't have any visuals let me show you that here it kind of sounds like that lava that we have on the masked style now i do want to do the built-in emote which is called mask up now since i did that emote the back bling was reactive during that process. Now, when I get an Elam with this edit style, you can see the reactivity here. So it does have the sound from this style on the original Slim Shady edit style, but you don't have any visuals. Let me do it again. And let me show you what happens when you have the headphone style equipped, which is a little weird to me. Before I jump back in with the headphone style, this is the second backlink called Mom's Spaghetti. You can see some steam coming off of it as well. I'm hoping the physics are good in the game. I haven't tried it yet in game yet, but here we go. The physics on Mom's Spaghetti are really fun here. I, don't, I was hoping for some sauce to kind of fall out and splash around. I don't see anything happening there. I do want to see if it does anything in the air here because sometimes it does slightly change what the backlink looks like seem like a lot goes on but i do like the physics with the noodles for sure now with this edit style which is labeled headphones you will notice that the headphones are always like a neon blue already like a little bit of a glow but they will become a lot brighter with an elim here as you can see we'll go slowly back to normal now with the built-in emote with the headphone style equipped okay i can do that here mask up which is fine we all know it's going to do that but if I go back with the mask up style, it will not take me back to the headphone style. It will take me back to the original Slim Shady year. So keep that in mind. It will not go back to your headphones. 
This is the second outfit of three in the M&M set called Marshall Nevermore. We do have edit style options here. We have the original. We have the sleeves rolled edit style, which does showcase some of his tattoos. And then we have the Marshall Noir edit style, which is a gray TV style, but it does have a red tie, which is a really nice little detail there. I like the uh, the grain as well from like an old TV. And then if you want to have the hat off for any of those styles, you have that option as well, which is nice. I like options for it, Knight. Thank you. Now, this backlink, which is the third one we're showcasing in the actual video, is called Raven's Stare. Not reactive, but it will match the second edit style option for our glider, which we'll get to very shortly. Then we have the Axe Bout Me, this is the second of two harvesting tools within this set. Give him a swing. Not reactive, keep that in mind. And then we have the edit style that we're gonna showcase in this gameplay called the Jet Fighter edit style for the Raven Express. Now I'm not gonna knock this Eminem outfit, but I do really, really relate to the Slim Shady one for sure. I believe I was in elementary school and Eminem came on the scene to my knowledge elementary school that's crazy this is the second edit style for the raven express i like this style a little bit more than the other one for sure i know black and red is super common but this looks good i do like this the thing crazy on the visuals a little bit more of a red contralo on that edit style of the glider equip and equip nothing crazy here with these dualies the chainsaw was pretty good though and then other materials here with weak points not reactive by the way keep that in mind i think it could have been for sure maybe the backwards e on the back bling and the harvesting tools could have been reactive to elims or emotes or something but it's not keep that in mind and then hitting opponents here sounds like a little hatchet sounds like it should this is the second edit style with the sleeves rolled here. And you know what? It's weird, but I kind of like it. More of a relaxed look here. Like I just got off. I've had a long day. <laughs> I don't know why. It's very basic, but it's kind of interesting. This Marshall Noir edit style might be my new favorite. I do like the sleeves rolled up, but this looks really cool in game. I enjoy this little film grain old TV style for sure. And then at night, it should look pretty cool as well. It does look good. That is a really cool effect on the outfit. We've seen this before. It's not the first time this has been done, but it does look really good here on the Marshall Noir edit style. All three styles with the hat off. Sleeves rolled. No hat. And the Marshall Noir. No hat. Looks cool. Looks really cool, actually. This is the third and final outfit in the M&M set called Rat Boy. Now, this looks like a job for me. Okay, now, it's not exactly like it was in that music video but we do have mask on and mask off for this edit style so i'm gonna show you that in game right now so this is definitely fun right this is fun mask on style here i'm not exactly sure like what i'm supposed to pair with the back blings etc um mom's spaghetti can go on anything you know what i mean so it is what it is Raven Express. Now, this looks great with this. It's got the black and red as well. And then the other edit style matches the tools and the back we just went over. So I, it's kind of it kind of feels like it's all slightly interchangeable for sure. You know, it does feel that way. And if you want to run the unmasked, if you can tell here, there is no mask over the eyes. Now, I really never thought with how soft Fortnite is appearing to become that Eminem would be in the game. You know what I mean? It's it's like, whoa, oh, E rated this. It's too scary. It's sharp. Oh my God, there's shotgun shells on the outfit. But hey, here's Eminem, which is cool. I love it. Do the children need to listen to Eminem? I don't know. At least they don't have the Eminem music in the game. <laughs> you know what I mean? Okay, so mom's spaghetti back bling on all the outfits here. In case you're a Kira's George, I'm pretty sure you can use them however you would like. I don't think there's any rules here specifically. Really fun back bling, um, fun outfits for sure. We have Rat Boy as well. And then we have Mom Spaghetti on Slim Shady. Would you please stand up? Headphones here. And then the Shady Demon. 
with Raven's stair, kind of already showed you this um, on this outfit, but we'll show you it just in case you're curious what it's going to look like here. They all look fine to me. We have Rat Boy here. Looks fine. And then on Slim Shady as well. I mean, it, it looks okay. I'm pretty sure they're all interchangeable here. No problems. And now the Shady Boombox on all the outfits here. Looks fine. No problems here. No problems here. Rat Boy as well. And then Slim Shady. Show you this one more time. I'm pretty sure we, we already showed you this, but we'll show you it anyway. Looks fine. Again, this releases tomorrow, November 29th. Epic Games, thank you for the early access. I hope you guys enjoy the set. Thank you guys so much for watching, and we'll see you on the live stream. See you.